There is one more reaction, sir, that I wanted to bring in. UB journalism professor Danilo Ara was saying, he put out this challenge on his Twitter account. UB faculty and alumni who are Duterte's top level officials should denounce Lorenzana's letter terminating the 1989 accord. This disregards everything UB stands for. Should they remain silent? A six word question. Where is your honor and excellence? So let me ask you, sir, are you denouncing this letter by Secretary Lorenzana um, as a former, as a UP student and as a former UP professor? Are you denouncing it? I'm asking the uh, DND secretary and the president of UP to sit down, and I've offered my good offices to facilitate this meeting. But the word is denounce, sir. Didn't denounce me who by it we're not speaking as a presidential and spokesperson. also presidential spokesperson. Well, there's really no such thing you know, when you are a presidential spokesperson. All I'm saying is, let's talk about this. I support the steps of the UP president, and let's see why a 30-year-old upward should not be continued when it has worked apparently perfectly well in the past 30 years. And so that doesn't make you silent on the issue because you're actually taking That's a step. It. And I'm not duty-bound to follow anything that Professor Arrow says. All right, presidential, <laughs> presidential spokesperson Harry Roque will still be with us after the break. Later, we're going to talk about government's vaccination program. Secretary Galvez will be speaking to uh, Senate President Tito Soto about this. We'll discuss this after the break. Source on CNN Philippines, our guest today, presidential spokesperson Harry Rokesek. I still need to do a follow up on this because now the Duterte Youth uh, Party list is seeking or asking that kung ano po yung ginawa sa UP, ayun din yung gawin sa PUP. Just wanted to get your thoughts on that, sir. Well, you know, it's a free country. If that is the thought of the Duterte Youth, so be it. And that's uh, something that the presidential spokesperson does not have to be involved with, no? But you know, Pinky, I have to highlight the fact that I think the question of Arau was unfair. In the first place, why am I to be bound to follow anything that Professor Arau says? Mm -hmm. You made it uh, appear as if it's compulsory for me to follow him. I spent more time in UP than him. Okay. And I think, uh, as I said, I even have like, uh, uh, I'm even a more senior academic than him. So it was not a fair question. I'm not to be bound to follow anything that Danny Arau says. Right. I should not Spokes, don't get me wrong. I, I wasn't saying you're yeah, shooting no, you were wrong. You I, were as, implying as if I had to follow what Danny Arrow has said. But what, what, what is the basis for that? It was a There's tweet, no sir. It was a tweet, Spokes, and then it just yeah, said you that... you said I had to follow him and in fact did not do as he did, then I have no honor or excellence. Is that a fair question? No, that's I not. didn't say that, Secretary Rocky. That's I what didn't. he said, though. That's what he said, and that's why I, I, I'm calling you out for that. Secretary Roque, okay, um, just to be very clear about this, it was a tweet that I read, and I asked for your reaction if you would denounce it. And then yeah, after uh, that... It's, uh, it's implying that I should find...